In this video, we're going to try to answer the question, how do you pronounce those three letters, S, Q, L? Hello, I'm Philip Burton of IDoData.com. So this is a fairly contentious question. How do you pronounce these three letters? Is it pronounced S, Q, L, or is it pronounced SQL? And, spoiler, you can pronounce it either way, and I don't mind which way you do. But it's interesting to look at the history of this and why these two different versions were created. So let's start off with Wikipedia. So structured query language brackets SQL, and here you can see the pronunciation SQL, sometimes SQL for historical reasons. And let's scroll down. So SQL was actually not the first name. There was a query language developed in the 1970s called QUEL. And so the name SQL or SEQUEL was a bit of a pun. It was a language which developed on QUEL. However, those six letters were actually a trademark in the United Kingdom. And so it later became SQL. We're still talking in the 1970s. By 1986, two official organisations adopted the standard database language SQL. So let's see what happens then in 1986. So the American National Standards Institute adopted SQL, as did the International Organisation for Standardization, the ISO. And the original SQL standard declared that the official pronunciation for those three letters is S. QL. And at this wiki page notes, many English speaking database professionals still use the non standard pronunciation like the word SQL, which refers to an earlier database language. If we look at another page, the introduction to SQL, you can see that the correct pronunciation of SQL is a contentious issue, definitely. In its SQL standard, the American National Standards Institute declared that the official pronunciation is SQL. However, many database professionals have taken to the slang SQL, much as with the pronunciation of GIF or GIF, there is no right answer. And that, I believe, is really the answer. There is no right answer. It depends what you use, but possibly more importantly, it depends what people around you use. So if people around you are using SQL, then you probably should use SQL just to fit in. If people around you are using SQL, then you probably should be using the word SQL. I was taken to task about this by one of my Udemy students who wrote in the Q&A forum, SQL mispronounced too much. Are you aware that SQL is pronounced SQL? It's rough listening to SQL over and over again. Well, the problem is, if I create a course based on SQL server, I can't say about a thousand times within the course, SQL or SQL. I've got to stick to one or the other. And I think it would be annoying if I went in two different versions, if I said SQL or SQL. Now, if I do a course which is not SQL based, so I just mention SQL or SQL once or twice, then I will say SQL or SQL, just to acknowledge this difficulty. However, I don't really mind. I pronounce it SQL. If somebody else wants to pronounce it SQL, that's absolutely fine by me. Just one other thing. This is the my followed by those three letters language. And you can see the website my followed by those three letters dot com. So this is an official site. Right at the bottom for this particular variant, it says the official way to pronounce these five letters is my SQL, not my SQL. But we do not mind if you pronounce it as my SQL or some other localized way. Now with my SQL, I hear more frequently my SQL than my SQL. But again, if you want to pronounce it my SQL, that's fine by me. So which way do you pronounce it? Why not let me know in the comments? And why not let me know if you've got any particular reasons why you pronounce it one way or the other? It might also be interesting if you let us know roughly your age. So I'd say 20s, 30s, 40s, 50s, 60s. I don't think you need to be more specific than that. It'd be interesting to see if there's a correlation between age and the pronunciation of these three letters. Well, I hope you enjoyed this rather contentious video. If you did, then why not like it? And why not subscribe and click that bell? That way, you'll be notified of any more contentious videos. And please, 
Give me a comment. Let me know how you pronounce it and why. I'm Philip Burton of idodata.com. Thanks for watching and keep learning.